New with the Winter 20 release, you can accept credit card payments from a community or Salesforce Lightning page and improve cash flow using Salesforce billing, hosted credit card payments. Let's take a look. I'm viewing a Salesforce community page as a prospect. From the home page, I see Jepson Incorporated has a new product on the market. As I begin to explore this product further, I notice I can sign up for a month-long trial. In order to start this trial, I will have to enter my credit card information. I go ahead and fill out the necessary fields directly from the home page. Since my credit card information is tokenized before it's saved, I can trust that my sensitive payment information is safe with Jepson. This is also good news for Jepson Incorporated. They are able to adhere to PCI compliance with ease, as they don't have to handle my credit card details directly. This information is tokenized by payment gateways and stored within Salesforce without Jepson Incorporated's intervention. I am now able to use the product for the trial period free of cost. Within Salesforce, my trial request created a lead that will convert to a customer account following my 30-day trial, and my tokenized credit card has been saved for future use. At the end of the trial period, a sales representative from Jepson Incorporated reaches out to me to get feedback on my experience and offers the premium version of the product for $58.99 per month, inclusive of taxes. I'm happy with the trial. Therefore, I agree to purchase the premium version of the product. However, I would like to use a new credit card for my monthly payments. The sales representative enters my new credit card information and saves the new card with auto pay for future payments. The sales representative then successfully processes my first payment. Salesforce Billing's hosted payment functionality makes it easy for your business to adhere to PCI compliance and receive timely payments from your customers.